<clears throat> this is the energy vibration reading for the general energies for the second quarter the second quarter is uh, the second um, three months of this year and um, this is from the month of April May until June so it's going to be spring it's going to be coming up to the time of spring and what is going to happen is that in this second quarter you have the energy of victory and success this is a fire energy that is going to happen in the second quarter the energy of victory and a success this quarter is going to have a fire energy okay because we have fire and earth energies we have two fire and two earth energies so um, for the people who are um, let's say uh, the people who are um, the uh, who has the energies of uh, the hurt people especially in the um, the month of May is going to be good for you for the fire people um, um, the Leos and the Sagittarius um, the month of uh, April is going to be extremely good for you guys and um, for the Sun is the energy of the um, the Sun is the energy of uh, the Sagittarian um, June is going to be a good month for you Sagittarians um, um, yeah, so you Sagittarians, because um, um, this is um, the form of energy that is coming in for because the sun is actually for the Sagittarians and the the Aries. Okay, so um, the Leos are going to be having a wonderful time in the month of April. So don't forget, you Leos, you're going to have a very positive time in the month of April, and uh, um, and then we have uh, the. Um, Capricorns are going to have a wonderful time in the month of May you Capricorns no Taurus and the Capricorns are going to have um, and you know the energy of the Empress is actually the energy of the Capricorns so you Capricorns and Tauruses are going to have a beautiful wonderful energies in the month of um, May and you Aries are going to have the energies in the month of um, in the month of um, uh, you Aries are going to have the energy in the month of uh, Tinder so what is happening um, for you guys is going to be um, extremely um, very very positive okay it's gonna be extremely extremely positive so let's go ahead and look and see because in the month of um, April you air you Leo's are going to have a wonderful wonderful it's also the energy vibration of this uh, second quarter it is uh, the energies of um, the energies of uh, the chariot which is wonderful and it's going to be a beautiful beautiful energy that is coming in in the month of April it's a fire energy month of May we have the energy of the Empress so for the Capricorns it's going to be a good in the month of May May is going to be a positive month for the Capricorns and the Tauruses it's going to be a good month for business and that sort of a thing if you're deciding to do business go ahead in a month in the month of um, May in a month of June month of June the energy of the Sun comes out for the Aries so whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening for the Aries in the month of June this is going to be um, a very positive we're going to look and see what else is coming out as we adjoin um, the month of uh, April and May to see what energies is going to come out the energy of the world is going to come out it's going to be a very positive energy with the energy of the world the, the world coming out so it's going to be an earth energy and this is going to be the ending of something and a new beginning is going to be coming in as we look at May and June let's see what is happening May and June you have the energies of uh, um, the three of ones the three of ones I think um, you have the energy of the three of ones so you're leaving a situation behind because a new beginning is coming in you have the energy of the tower I'm sorry ladies and gentlemen it's the energy of the tower that is coming down 
whatever the situation is the energy of the tower is coming down because there's a victory and success and the energy of the Empress is here it looks like the world I'm so sorry my darling so the energy of the tower um, <clears throat> with your joining of April and May the energy of the tower is here and then um, in the month of uh, May going to June you are going to have the three of one so a lot of changes is going to be happening for the Capricorns where you have the energy of the three of ones where you're leaving things behind and you're moving forward so for the Capricorns you know this is going to be the energy that is taking place so the outcomes um, for this quarter for um, the general energies and this is the general energies ladies and gentlemen the outcomes for the second quarter it is going to be the energy of temperance the energy of temperance because there's a victory and success and then you are going to have the energy of a temperance coming in okay so this I'm going to move the cards up a little bit so we can have some space because this is the energies that are coming in and um, the energies of temperance and this energy of temperance that is coming in is just a, so a sort of a weird energy because we have this um, um, person with a green eye with eight and envy it's a sort of a hate and envy red eyes okay it's a sort of a hate and energy uh, uh, um, so you really have to because what is happening is as if um, whatever the situation that is transpiring whatever that is a tr a transpiring in, in the spirit because you have the energy of fire we have fire energies and these fire energies because we have the, the tower and then we have um, the three of ones which is an earth um, and, and another fire energy because one's energy is a passion it's a fire and then you have temperance and temperance is an earth energy that is actually grounding um, this situation that is um, that is um, transpiring so um, this is going to be good because um, whatever is transpiring is as if the universal angels and guides are coming in to make sure and try to make a sort of a um, situation that is going to be happening um, whatever is going to be transpiring whatever is going to be happening um, you are going to be seeing um, these changes coming up so we are going to look and see what connections with all these connections that is happening um, in in these months with the energy because it's going to be a fire passionate um, quarter this quarter is going to be very fiery very passionate it's going to be a quarters that we are going to be looking at certain aspect of what is going to transpire because with all these energies there's a lot of stuff that is happening so um, the connection and the joining and the connection um, with April and May with energies uh, of the tower coming you are going to receive a positive positive energy which you have the energy of the world because um, the, the, whatever uh, the victorious and success whatever is the victory and success that is coming out the energy of the world is coming in so um, it's, it's a wonderful energy that is going to be connecting and placing um, positive energies uh, um, within this um, quarter. So let's look at May going in. Um, um, the the energy of May going in um, to June. Um, you have the seven of swords and the seven of swords. Um, the seven of swords whatever the situation is the seven of swords it's there is going to be because you um this is the, the sword energy is a hair energy so you guys have to really 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 be um aware of the things that is going on because you have the energy of the swords that is happening here and that is transpiring here so we are going to look what is the adjoining for 
um, the extras of the energy of the tower there's something breaking down with energies of the tower and all of this thing whatever your sadness is it's no more going it's not going to be there anymore whatever sadness and whatever situation you need to um, to find because the energy of the sadness is in the reverse form which is very good because what is happening is that you need um, to bring out and find balance in certain situation and certain things that is going to go on in your life okay so we're going to move forward and we're going to look and see what is happening um, with the sense of relationship because it's very important that we know exactly what is happening in the sense with relationship what to expect in the sense of relationship or what to expect in the sense of relationship okay um, what I'm seeing coming up here um, in the sense of relationship we you are going to win um, um, a lot of people there is going to be a winning especially for the Virgos or um, uh, for the Virgos but yet still the Taurus people there is going to be a winning okay the nine of ones you're you're protected okay so um, if there was a situation where there was conflicts in a situation and that sort of a thing okay um, um, the energies of this third quarter is going to be extremely good because what is happening in this third quarter is that um, you are going to realize and see that there is going to be a big a big victory um, and a big victory and a winning that is coming up because whatever that has transpired a big victorious win is going to be coming up and this is going to be good okay um, this is a wonderful situation um, for um, <clears throat> the people and situation that is happening in your life because um, it's as if justice um, there is a stand of justice it's as if um, the energies are going to be um, so coming out that the stand of justice is going to be there so if you are having legal situation most people will realize and see um, a changes for the best in these um, legal situation that is coming up and it, it is going to be helping some of you to move forward okay and this is going to be good because um, it's as if there is more um, more energies coming in there is going to be more energies that is coming in and um, a balancing out of all the stuff that has been going on so a lot of stuff is going to be balanced out in whatever that has been going on that was injustice okay so um, here you can see that whatever situation that has been taken place whatever the situation that has transpired in your life in um, whatever area of your life you are going to be seeing that these situations are really 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 going to be um, closing off in a good positive way okay in a very very good positive way so um, this is um, actually a very very good um, endings um, um, situation that is going to be happening for a lot of people out there a lot of people are going to be realizing that whatever injustice and inequalities that has happened to you you are spiritually protected in this because obviously um, the energies are, are showing here and um, it's all about balancing out a lot of stuff and there's going to be a lot of protection for a lot of people so if you have been going through a um, situation of injustice because we have the energy of the world here and whatever opposition that was playing the energy of the Sun is coming out and this is going to bring balance okay let's look at your love situation so first we're going to look at the fire sign people to see um, what is happening for love with the fire sign people um, what is happening for love okay for the fire sign people okay um, let's see 
so whatever that is happening for love for the fire sign people with the Pentacles people the Sun is gonna come out in their love relationship so and then we have one more sign to do and the water sign people the water sign people okay so let's look at the situation for um, the fire sign people um, there is going to be a magical event that is going to happen in love and what is happening is that the universal angels and guides is going to bring in positive energies for you um, guys okay it's as if you're going to start to learn to love yourself but learn to also connect with other people in um, a wonderful way because the energy of uh, um, the energy of this hair sign is, is as if um, it's bringing in um, because this is the energy of the Aquarian the energy of the justice um, this is the, the energy of Gemini's so a lot of you are going to be having situation especially the people who are in relationship with the Gemini's a lot of situation is going to be coming up for you to work out um, relationship situation so if you have situationship with Gemini's a lot of you people are going to be um, having this coming up for the heart sign people it's gonna be good in the second quarter of the year 2018 with love it's going to be wonderful it's gonna be good it's gonna be positive because whatever is and was happening in your love relationship this is going to turn for the best so in relationships and love relationship whatever that was happening and transpiring this is going to um, be turning out for the best for you guys okay we are going to look at the energy um, oh here was the the king of Pentacles I was looking for him I couldn't find him okay so we're looking at the air sign people and this is the um, Aquarius the Gemini's um, the Aquarius the Gemini's and the Librans in love there is uh, a lot of conflicts a lot of conflicts whatever the conflicts there's gonna be a lot of conflicts that is coming up for you um, and love whenever the five of swords comes up is just a lot of conflicts you people are going to be having conflicting situations with relationships and that sort of a thing a whole lot of conflicts will be coming up for you air sign people in the second quarters especially in relationship a whole lot of conf conflicts whatever the conflicts is whatever the situation that is transpiring in your life there is going to be a whole lot of conflicts that is coming up for you guys okay a whole lot of conflicts for you guys in relationships so you have to be and especially if you're in relationship with other air sign people there is where this conflict in relationship is going to come up now we're looking at the energies for the uh, Pisces cancer and scorpion and this is going to be wonderful for the Pisces cancer and scorpion this is going to be wonderful because you have the energy of your wishes and dreams are coming true um, the nine of cups which um, a lot of you will be finding the right relationship and the right people to be involved with and this is going to be good because you're going to be feeling very happy very very happy um, in your relationship so whatever the situation is and whatever that is transpire you are going to be um, feeling feeling very very happy in this situation and whatever is going on okay um, so overall for love it's going to be different for a lot of people because what, what, what is happening here is really a transition this um, quarter from April until June it's all about the hurt and fire sign okay um, for the hair sign people and this is why the energy of love comes up where there is going to be a lot of sort of a relationship that are happening around you which um, is the sense of uh, um, you need to really balance out a certain situations that is going on around you okay um, um, I have decided if I can find it because sometimes I've decided on one thing and then um, this um, quarter for you guys it's going to be the quarter of currency and it is the frequency of currency supporting our ability 
to normalize the frequency of the heart with the frequency of the mind for an optional um, ability to create the realities uh, that we desire okay so um, this is the energy that is coming in the activation energy because every quarter I'll be every quarter a month I'll be bringing in the activation energies because this is wonderful because we need to activate certain aspect of ourselves that is not in variable with or um, with working with who we are um, on this planet so um, here we are we're having um, these sort of a uh, energies that are going to be coming up okay we're also going to use the ascendance masters because we need to learn who the ascendance masters is and we need to work with them so um, and this is a general energy so what we're seeing coming up is uh, the cosmic heart so um, a lot of us we need to connect with a cosmic art I am the cosmic art we need to connect with a cosmic art so this card is inviting you to open up your heart fully and attune into the love radiation from Venus which is the center of the universe okay pure uncondition unconditional love is held within the Venus and at the ninth dimensional frequency a higher frequency that you can currently access okay the angels are suggesting that you all find time to today or whenever you can call upon Archangel Mary um, mother Mary and the unicorns because mother Mary has her own unicorns um, and ask for their help um, for you to step down the powerful but gently love to a level you can handle and bring it into the heart center breathe in love from the cosmic art and radiate this outwards uh, uh, to everyone and then you can say the affirmation I am the cosmic heart okay so here I am leaving you guys with the energy of um, this quarter and it is um, the second quarter enjoy whatever is coming in for you and know that life is full of a lot of surprises and we just have to ride with the wave of what is happening in our lives okay so namaste until next time